Hi, I've been playing Minecraft for a little while now, and um, I've also been watching a guy on YouTube. His name is X, and he has his own little series, X's Adventures in Minecraft. It's incredibly addicting for me, and uh, I wanted to kind of create something similar. I know it won't be as good, but um, I think my audience will be a lot smaller than his. Um, mainly a few people that I know, probably. It doesn't even need to get any larger than that. I mostly want to share this with them. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I do have a world already that I've been playing in. Only one world so far. And I think I want to create a whole new world and start fresh for the sake of this video. And, uh, we'll see how that goes. Okay, this is actually a really excellent spawn. Um, I, I really wanted to uh, keep pretty close to my spawn area for my first shelter and home. Um, I, I kind of trekked a little far away in my first uh, world, and it's kind of annoying when I die, which I think probably happens far too often. But there's some coal right up there. Guess what I really need. There's no trees here though. That's not so good. There's trees over there. Like I said, I kind of want to keep it close though. So what I may do. Uh, I really need wood. Alright, well I gotta go chase down wood. And then I come back to this area. I need some wood so that I can make some tools. Yeah, that, that will be. Oh yeah, look, see, there's some more caves over this way. That's pretty nice. It's been a while since I started with nothing, so just breaking up this tree and collecting some wood. And then with this wood, I can make planks. And then, let's see, with these planks, I can make a workbench. And now, we'll take this back. Any other close trees? Not really. There's some coal, that's really useful. But like I said, I kind of want to make my first shelter just really, really close to my spawn area. I, I probably will branch out from there, but initially I definitely want to keep it real close um, so that I don't have to run far in the event that I die really quickly. Um, I'll just tuck myself back in here. This is gravel. I mean, heck, just clearing away this gravel might create a, a good enough shelter for the first night. I should mention that I've had trouble with this game freezing on me, and I'm not exactly sure why that is. <clears throat> I uh, did a whole bunch of stuff to try to avoid that with this game. I don't know if it'll work. I guess we'll find out. Alright, I should... This is pretty good to get me what I, I need. I guess I guess it's about time to uh, create my first set of tools here. Go ahead and lay down my workbench. And then on my workbench, well, I actually don't even need a workbench to create sticks. But, and in case you didn't see, I did that pretty fast. I'm, trying not to move too quickly even though I've played this already. Um, two of these wooden planks like that will create sticks. And uh, sticks can be used to create tools like a pick, which is very useful. And also a shovel, which is very useful at clearing away this gravel. Um, you saw me clearing it away with my hand with the shovel obviously much faster. 
But what I really wanted to do is go grab some of this coal so that I have some for the night. And for that, I'll use my pick. In case you're wondering, and you haven't played Minecraft before, that music is coming from the game. This is a nice pocket of coal for sure. And the reason I'm getting coal whoops, is uh, because at night time the uh, mobs will start to spawn, monsters will spawn out on the ground. And so I'm creating myself a small little shelter and uh, the monsters will only spawn where there is no light. It doesn't mean they have to stay where there's no light. They just can't spawn where there's no light. So what I plan to do is collect a little bit of this coal. There we go. I'm actually going to collect a little bit of this stone. Not too much though, because I'm pretty sure that once I close up shop for the night in my house, I will... Uh, I will be able to mine all the stone I want. So, sun's directly overhead, so we've used about half the day now. And I'm going to go ahead and take... Oh, I have no sticks left, so... Uh, make some sticks. And with that, I should be able to make some torches. I really need more wood. That's what I really need. Because I'm going to want more tools. As a matter of fact, I've, got, I've only got two. But what I can do is I can make one more stick. Well, four more sticks. And then I can use the stone I've collected and make myself an axe. And... I don't have enough stone for picks. Oops. I didn't mean to throw that. So I'm going to go grab one more stone. There we go. And then I'll make myself a stone pick for the night, too. Take these sticks. And with my stone like a stone pick. Uh, the, the reason you want to make uh, stone tools versus wood tools is they just last longer and they actually cut through um, the material faster. Um, where's that sun? Still quite high. Oops. So I'm gonna try to go find some more wood. And it looks like the wood that I can get access to is all up here. So. collect some of this wood because it's going to be useful for torches and tools and really everything. It's kind of addicting to just running around and collecting materials here. I do want to stop collecting in a short bit. There's a whole bunch of trees here so that's good and it's not too far away from me. probably lay down some dirt at some point so I can plant trees a lot closer to home. Well, can't quite reach that. Oh, Alright. Well, like I said, I just wanted to collect enough. That's 31 logs that I'll create quite a few. And, it, and you see these little saplings are dropping from the leaves as they disappear. And you can plant those in, in grassy areas. So if I can safely make my way back down here. Like this. Look at this cave system. This is all stuff I will uh, 
attempt to explore once the once I've created myself a small little shelter and built up some supplies here. My little home should be back in here. My spawn area is about right where I'm standing, I think. And uh, as you can see, it's starting to get dark. The sun is... I'm in this valley, so I can't see the sun anymore, but I know it's going down because it's getting dark. So I will throw up a couple of my torches in this little area here. And I, what do I have on me? I've got gravel. Uh, it's not my favorite material. I don't like how it reacts to gravity. Um, so I don't really like using it a whole bunch, but I'm going to use it now so that I can create myself a little area that's safe. I'm going to leave myself a tiny window up high so uh, monsters can't shoot in, but I can still see out until when it's turned into daytime again. So now that it's getting dark out there, I'll start working on the inside here. Just going to hollow out a little area. I used up my wood pick. Time to move on to the stone. As you can see, just by merely clearing out this area for me to live in, I'm collecting plenty of stone. Which is why I didn't make too much of an effort to collect it outside. I'm going to have to collect that. Put that here instead. Okay, so as you can see I've hollowed out a little bit more. of this area. And it'll provide a good place for me to uh, hold up for the night, stash my stuff. I'll put another torches on the wall. Whoops. Okay. break up my workbench and move it out of the center of the room now. And, uh, I'll place it down. Let's see, I'll place it right here for now. And then on it, well, I guess first of all, it's logs are pretty useless by themselves. Uh, they, they, I guess you could use them to build with maybe, but planks are much more useful and you get four planks for every log. So as you can see I get a lot of wood just from those 31, 31 logs. And I can use the wood for a lot more. Uh, let's see. Well, I'm trying to think of what I want to do first. I guess I should create myself some storage bins. Um, I know I can do... whoops, I can't do that without my crafting table. See, I, if you notice, if I'm looking just in my inventory, I just have this four block crafting table. I can make smaller things like um, planks I could have made in here, sticks I can make in here, um, torches if I had a stick and a piece of coal, just a single thing. But every, a lot of my other things like my tools and, and, and um, uh, most everything else actually needs the bigger area. I'm going to make myself a chest which I know is just by drawing like that. That's a good way for me to be able to store my stuff. And I also want to make myself an oven, uh, which I know is made like that. Same way, different materials. And the chest I will set here, and it's facing the right way. I have such trouble with this sometimes, especially the stoves, let's see. And it's facing the right way, that's pretty good. And then in my chest I can place stuff like flint that I have no use for cur currently and um, you know extra wood because I don't need more than 47 on me at one point <laughs> keep the coal on me so anyway uh, as you can see I made myself a tiny little shelter to, to ride out the night and um, I think I'm gonna stop my first video here see how it goes